Hi, this is Tarina. Keep watching for my smoky evening look tutorial. I'm always anxious to get to work because of the excitement that usually awaits me. I love the creative process, meeting with my amazing team and getting inspired for future collections, and all the projects we tackle each day. My years as a makeup artist and designer have given me a unique perspective on beauty. I am so passionate about innovative product formulation and beautiful packaging design. You know, makeup is a lot like jewelry and the beauty is in the exquisite details. So I spend countless hours sweating those details with one goal in mind, to arm you with everything you need to create your own unique style. This is one of those sparkling moments that I love. I feel like a starlet in one of those old Italian films. This evening I'm hosting a small dinner party at my home to celebrate with family and friends. I love this time of day. This is my time when I get to sit down at my vanity and play with my makeup and jewelry and get inspired for my makeup looks. The lighting at night is different, so keep that in mind when you're doing your makeup. You want to bring as much light to the face as possible. One of my favorite looks for evening is a sparkling smoky eye paired with a more neutral lip. So what I'm going to do to start is I'm going to use my Tommy Jet eyeliner. So I'm going to begin on the inner corner of my eye and line towards the center. I like my eyeliner as close to the lash line as possible. And don't worry if it's not perfect because we're going to smudge it out later. On the outer corner of my eye, I like to wing it up a little bit. I formulated this liner to last all day and the best part, it's waterproof, which means you can also use it in your waterline. To achieve this look, I'm going to use my Jewel Shadow Palette in Lovely. It has everything you need to achieve the perfect smoky eye. I'm going to start with my pigment brush with this beautiful shimmering taupe. I'm going to apply it over my entire lid from my lash line to my crease. Okay, so next I'm going to use this beautiful gunmetal shade. And again, I'm going to use my pigment brush. And I'm going to apply it from the center of my lid to my outer corner. Now it's important that you concentrate this color right in this area because this is going to create great depth for your smoky eye. So now I'm gonna take my crease brush and I'm gonna use the very, very, very tip. I'm gonna go back into that dark gunmetal color and I'm gonna create a V on the outer corner of my eye. This is going to lift and add just the right amount of drama to my eye look. Next, I'm going to take my smudge brush and this great matte black shade Again, with the very tip, and then we're going to just press it along the upper lash line. This is gonna smooth out my liner, and it's gonna make it last longer. Next, I'm gonna take my magical little smudge brush again, and I'm gonna go back into this gunmetal color right on the tip. This time, I'm going to use it along my lower lash line. Don't worry about it looking too intense because we can go back and soften it later. What I love about this shadow is that when it spills into the water line, it gives a beautiful shimmering effect. So next I'm gonna highlight my brow bone and I'm going to use my pigment brush, but this time I'm just gonna use the very, very tip. I'm gonna use this beautiful shimmering bisque color. Going right into the arch of my brow and I actually like to blend it out a little bit to help highlight my eyebrow. As you see, you don't need much. My hyper shadows are really highly pigmented. Next, one of the most important elements of any eye look, the inner eye highlight. I'm going to use my smudge brush and I'm going to use this beautiful silver color. I'm just going to apply it to the very tip of the brush and just sweep it along the inner corner of the eye and about three quarters of the way out across your lower lashes. Next, I'm going to add Eye Dream Hyper Liner in Crystal Gun along my waterline to really make that color pop. Crystal Gun puts that twinkle in your eye and really makes your eyes look wide and bright. Now is my favorite part, giving your eyes that jewel-like effect with my Sparklicity Pure and my blending brush. I'm gonna dip the tip and I'm gonna sweep it over my entire eye, mostly concentrating it on the inner corner. Now we're gonna finish this eye look with a coat of Fleur de Lash Mascara. Next, using my Doll Skin Blush and Feather, I'm going to concentrate the blush on the apples of my cheeks to give me that doll-like look. You can also sweep the color along your cheekbone 
for more definition, like that disco cheek effect. Now I'm gonna apply my conditioning lip sheen in Cameo for that neutral lip. I love this lipstick. It feels so good going on. How gorgeous is that? That's the perfect neutral shade to balance out this dramatic eye look. And now the final touch, my Sparklicity Gloss in Payette. This gloss is like jewelry for your lips. It's like tiny jewels suspended in the gloss and gives your lip look definition and depth. Concentrate the gloss in the center of your lips to make your lips look fuller. And remember, no look is complete without a little extra sparkle. So I like to use my Sparklicity Shimmer Dust. Just a couple little spritzes will give you the perfect amount of shimmer. And now for the best part, showing off your beautiful makeup. In my mind, I've captured this moment and put it in a bottle. Who says you can't live the sparkling life? Get ready to sparkle.